<laughs> You're almost ready to take on anyone, Chris. <sighs> I'm almost ready. Almost. Let's t let's head to Tarkin. Show me the way to Nicol Bolas. I'll take him down by myself. On your own, mate. Yes. On your own. I've learned many spells, like Knight's Pledge. I've learned many spells. And spell. Lemon Pledge. <laughs> <laughs> lemon <laughs> Pledge. Uh, and Pledge the Allegiance. Watch her <laughs> every flag. Anything. All right. She's oh. only got. We always oh, had ten and ten life max. This opponent has spells that can be cast on your oh, turn. So this is what we just mentioned: instant spells. Instant spells can be cast on anyone. Instantly. <laughs> <laughs> they can be cast on anyone's turn, as long as you have the mana for it at any time. Instantly. Let's get the cat out. Cat's Let out the, the cat bag. bag. Enjoy the guild pack today, folks. This is the only <laughs> hive mind. Hive mind. Guild packed. Join the Golgari Swarm hive mind. Easy, tiger. Right. You still here? Now then. Let's see what she's going to do. I think she might have something up her sleeve here. There we this go. This is my favourite. Oh, here we go. This is my least favourite part. So, now we start to introduce the stack. What has happened here is we have sent our creature... To her, towards her face, but she has placed on top of it um, an instant card uh, which will destroy the target creature with power two or less, which our cat was. And so when the stack resolves, it goes backwards. So uh, her instant cast first before our damage did. So the instant came down, destroyed my creature, so I don't get to attack. Planes first. Yep. Try and keep her. If there's a land in your hand, Play the land. You damn manned. You forgot what you're saying was, didn't you, already? Or woman. No, I don't. I just thought. <laughs> right, this is important. Flash. Ah! Tell us about Flash, Chris. Flash. So Flash means that it negates the rules of when it can be cast. So this is a creature, normally only castable on your turn, but because it's got Flash, it can be played at any point, including an opponent's turn. It's almost like an instant card, but for uh, creatures. creatures, not yeah. magic. So the effect of this is we've swung in and then she's surprised us with a flash card, which she could instantly make block, which she did, which traded our creature. Mm -hmm. Nothing we could do to stop that. Yeah. And then obviously it's a great time to play that card just to point out because she had the mana to do so. So she played that card to stop direct damage to her, which tapped mana, but then it was her turn again instantly, so her mana immediately untapped. That's really important when you get into complicated turns when you're trying to manipulate the way you use your mana. You might want to save some of that to do something specific at the end of your turn or at the end of somebody else's turn. You can say uh, sometimes you have the ability to cast something before their end step even ends and your turn begins. So you can cast something at the end of their turn, like a flash card or an instant card, and then immediately your upkeep begins and you untap it straight away. So you've yeah. just been able to cast that for free, essentially. Instead of trying to preempt everything, maybe act reactionally is what you keep your mana up for. Yes. Yeah, good, good thinking. So let's try again. What are you going to do this time? Every action. There we go. So going. another flash card. She's going to send it in to block it. Now we kill it and keep our shrine keeper. Oh, here we go. As an additional cost to this spell, sacrifice a creature and draw two cards. This is clever. This is called Alter Reap. So what, okay. what she's done... So this is, like Richard said, affecting the stack. Yes. So this is now... We're in the middle of combat. She's put out a flash card that is now blocking... So our damage is blocked. It won't go through now. But she's now going to sacrifice that creature. So our damage is still not going through. But then it's also not destroying the creature because she's using the creature as a sacrifice. Incredibly smart move. And gets to draw two cards as well. Aww, we don't even get a hit in. No, we don't get a hit in because the stack goes backwards. It goes, it goes down from what we've been... Uh, yeah. What we've seen play. 5-5. Five, five. Enters the battlefield, deep 5 damage to target opponent. Ooh. That's us. Okay, so if we hover over this uh, card, it's got another effect. So, Soul Hunter Rakshasha? 
That creature can't block. So that is essentially just a glass hammer. It's just going in, it's just attacking. Mm. We can swing past it as much as we want. So that is ours to destroy. Be careful. Essentially. You can't afford to take another hit. So let's have a look at what instant card we drew this turn. Target blocking or block creature you control gets plus two plus two. So when we think about that, we're gonna have, when he attacks us next turn, we're going to have a six six versus his five five, we'll destroy it. Yeah, so the let's... only reason we can do that is if we scroll over the card again, it's an instant. So like I said, we would play that reactively. When that attacks, we trick her the same way she's been tricking us. So we go in for the block and then we buff our creature. Stack resolves, our creature becomes blocked, and then it blocks, destroying their creature. All right, so let's do it. Let's send the block. Cast it now. Now, we cast it, put it on our creature. 2-2 two, two coming in. Boom! Tricked you. Didn't Ooh. see it coming. And because it's an, Got him. Because it's an aura, we get to keep the, uh, the plus two, plus two. So, let's go to next. I think she's going to have something up her sleeve again. Quite possibly. Here we there go. We go. So Another flash. A double, double oh. flash. But ready. we have five mana. We do. And we have an instant. So let's add to the stack our instant card that gives us an extra plus two plus two. It's a double, a double plus two plus two. So she thought she had us then. She put down two damage, two, two damage creatures thinking that it would take away our four life destroying our creature mm, then nothing. like richard said we added to the stack again mm. we gave it plus two now in this t in this uh instance um and it was and it reads till end of turn when our turn ended we lost that extra plus two effect um we keep the enchantment aura on because that doesn't have an until end of turn condition uh right now we pass turn we have another instant card it's pretty pretty nice so do we want to see what that does Cast this spell only if a creature is attacking you and it creates three 1-1 one, one spirit creature tokens with flying. All right, so we won't be using that this turn anyway. Let's send for her way. She's got nothing to, to say for it now. Looks like you've let your guard like like down. Except we haven't. We're not telling her that we haven't. Shh, let the guard it's down. It's a secret. She doesn't know we've got this Look at all these flash cards. She's got flash. Ah. And they're only one, one toughness. And she... Because they are flash, what we didn't notice then was she played them at the end of our turn, which means it then becomes her turn, meaning they bypass the summoning sickness because they've already been out for a turn and been untapped. Mm, interesting. But now we get to uh, block them anyway. Yes. Because we can create those and these guys can block immediately. They have summoning sickness, which means they can't attack, but like you should remember, they can block. And so they're just throwaways. Get them out of my sight. Just a big ghosty uh, why shield. Die? Why won't you die? I mean, yeah. <laughs> rude. <laughs> rude, yeah. Now you've got her. Okay, so four. And we're going to give it a plus three. So obviously she's going to be dead. She's got nothing in her hand now. Look, she's got also, no cards left. We now just gave it flying. As we've seen from all her previous cards, mm. her flash cards don't have flying. No. So it would even if she had creatures up right now on the board, we'd just fly over the top of them. And that's it. That's that's uh, that's another win. Oh, that God. is my fourth win ever. That is insane. Take me to Nico Bolas. Take, take me. Screw Liliana. Yep. Screw Gideon. Screw him. Screw uh, Dak. Dak. Rip Dak. Rip Dak. Big Rip Dak. <laughs> Don't rip your Dak. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> screw Jace. Screw. That was some quick Tezzeret. Yeah. Screw, screw, definitely screw Tezzeret. Screw Nissa. Screw, screw Nissa. Ajani. Ajani. Screw Ajani. <laughs> Any other players yeah. walk. Khan. Khan. Screw Khan. Ra oh my god, here he is! I regret it. Take it back. Hold me. Nick Obolas. <laughs> it's okay, Chris. Nick Obolas. <laughs> <laughs> After I've annihilated you. Oh my god. I didn't expect it. Are we Jace? Are we Gideon? We know from the from the video that you can watch now on our channel about the story that this could potentially mean we're Gideon or Jace or any of the gay watch. I'm not ready. 
It's okay. We can do this. 